Let's create some broken text. First, we have our document created, and we want to go ahead and fill it. I'm going to fill mine with a back black ground color. And then I want to grab my artistic text tool, and I have impact font selected. We're going to type out the word broken. And we're going to grab our move tool, and we're going to stretch that and make it bigger. a little bit more there we go and then we're going to come to our pixel layer here and we're going to lock it and then we're going to click on our text layer and we're going to go down here and add a new pixel layer and then we're going to highlight the pixel layer and our text layer by clicking on them both and we're going to right click and we're going to merge visible and then we're going to take the original pixel layer and the original text layer and we're going to delete those and we're going to turn on our guides make sure they're on and we're going to add some guides we'll go to view make sure show guides is on you'll need to show your ruler too as well to get that and let's just we're going to drag one guide down to about the middle and let's drag another guide over oh, about right let's say about right there it doesn't have to be exact and let's put this one say about right there Okay, now that we have our guys in place to give us some points of which to work with, we're going to click on our pen tool. If you don't see your pen tool, it's because it's under the node tool here. So make sure you got your pen tool. And let's just click into the corner here. And we'll go up out. And we'll go across. We're just making angles. We're just going to make some angles. And we're going to join them. And then we're going to go up here. You see where it says pen right here? Got mask and selection. We're going to click on selection. Then we're going to click our move tool. And we're going to click in our uh, selection. And we're going to drag it just a little bit. Not quite that, but there we go. And then we're going to go up here and we're going to uh, select, deselect. And we're just going to rinse and repeat that process. Go down to the pen tool. And let's grab, uh, we'll put one here. And let's take an angle about like that. And we'll set about right here. And let's go back up and join that. And then we'll go up here, we'll make that selection. We're going to click our move tool. We'll click in here, make sure we have our handle shown for the selection. And let's just drag that a little bit. And then we'll go up here to select and deselect. And we will rinse and repeat. We'll do one here. And we will go up here and selection. And we will take our move tool and we will drag that just a little bit. And then we will go up to select, deselect. And then let's do rinse and repeat that again. Let's go here. And we'll go way up here. And let's say about right here. And we'll go down here. And we'll go to make our selection. Click our move tool. Make sure the handles show up. And we'll move it a little bit like that. And then we'll go to select. Deselect. And let's just put a big old giant one right in the middle here. Let's see. Let's come from this here. And let's go to here. And let's say here. And we'll join there. We'll go to uh, make our selection. Grab our move tool. And we'll just bring it about like that. And then deselect. And let's make some. I, so I think you should be getting the picture by now how to do this, right? So we're going to grab the pen tool. And we're going to go here. 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 And we'll go to make our selection. And we'll grab our move tool. We'll just pull that a little bit like that and then we'll go 
select deselect and that should be enough to get you going right get you started on how to how to to uh create broken text and that's really all there is to it just helped you how about leaving a thumbs up a comment subscribe share this channel with someone i would appreciate it and you have a good day